it's the perfect time to look at another quad this uh, just came in it's the idea fly f uh, 210 it's a small class fpv racer quad which comes in a nice uh, carrying case this is the quad uh, the name is uh, pretty straightforward this has a uh, size of uh, 210 that's why it's called uh, that way and it comes uh, fully FPV equipped it has uh, FPV dedicated camera here with adjustable tilting angle it can go up to almost 45 degrees so you can fly it really aggressive it has uh, 2204 motors that have uh, 2300 kV rating it uh, runs uh, standard on a 3 cell battery which goes here you can see it has a low profile body it has a F3 flight controller and it comes also with a power distribution board underneath uh, it has here a control switch for turning on or off the video transmitter which is also installed here you should take note that if uh, mine came with this powered on powered on it's this way and if you start it without an antenna you may burn the transmitter so take care with that uh, it also has uh, some useful landing gear and motor protections and uh, the ESCs are only good with uh, double sided tape as you can see here so it's recommended to use a zip tie it even has a notch on each arm where the zip ties should uh, sit uh, to secure them better right so I'm going to put this tie in the box you also get a uh, the standard balance charger the battery which has no brand but it has some info on it 30C 3 cell 1500 milliamps right the transmitter which looks uh, similar to another model uh, this uh, may be just a rebrand and has here two position switch this is a three position switch this is a working knob another knob this is yet again a three position switch and a two position switch this is not throttle spring loaded so it's not auto centering it's normal and this is automatic centering spring loaded right so on the run you also get this little FPV screen like this it has here power on switch and as it runs charges over a micro USB port and has a few buttons on top for changing channel frequency plus minus and a menu and that's about it it also has here a jack which I suppose it's a video out for connecting the recorder to it that will prove useful and here on the top of the bag we get more stuff which is the charger adapter for the balance charger FPV antenna one is for the quad the other is for the receiver the white one is for receiver this one goes onto the quad also get some zip ties bag with accessories here is the video cable which is analog this should connect to the monitor uh, micro USB cable for connecting to the flight controller and uh, tuning it this also acts as a charger for the FPV monitor and the mounting bracket 
that should uh, fix the monitor to the transmitter but there is a problem with it this will not fit this type of transmitter because this does not have a metal bar here, a rounded metal bar and this will not fit here so you can not use this fixing hardware this is where the metal bar should go and it will not go and uh, this is for uh, this adapter here this goes like this it has some screws there and this one will go like this and hold the monitor this one gets another screw and will go into this place like this so you can adjust the angle but you cannot fix it to the transmitter so not very good further on you get pre-baited props and R5030 and uh, there are two pairs here a disk drive and two bladed propellers also 5030 and here we get two pairs and a black pair also so that's all the included accessories uh, too bad that the monitor will not fit the transmitter but I don't want to use that monitor because I'm going to use my FPV goggles to this quad and uh, that will be on the following test flight which is going to happen uh, very soon until then bye bye